Hi, in this video, I'm going to teach you the analytical method of hypnotizing someone. You know, anyone who can understand the language can be hypnotized. However, since there's many different types of minds, there's many ways to hypnotize them. So in this series, I'm going to describe most of the methods that we teach in our hypnosis certification course. Now, who are the analytical people? Well, these are those tough nuts, the ones that people have difficulty relaxing, okay? You've probably hypnotized some of these before. You, you're doing this nice relaxation method, and all of a sudden, person opens his eyes. He goes, this is boring, okay? There are people who don't enjoy relaxing. They can, but they prefer keeping their minds busy. So maybe the ones that are more uh, resistant, the ones that analyze. If you say, oh, it's a field of wildflowers, you're going, why do I want flowers? Okay. <laughs> so they can be hypnotized just as easy as the people I showed you in the previous video, the ones that you relax. In fact, it's even easier to hypnotize someone who's analytical because all you need to do is keep their minds busy. They don't like to relax, so if you can't relax them, keep their mind busy. It's kind of like doing your taxes and having a conversation at the same time. you got to let go of one or the other. So if you're focusing on your taxes and your kid is behind you saying, Dad, can I borrow the car keys so I can go wrap the car around a tree outside? And you go, uh-huh. Okay, you're taking in everything. You're just not screening it. And that's basically what hypnosis is, is to get the suggestions from the conscious mind to the subconscious mind without that conscious mind resisting and fighting them. So let's talk about the analytical method. Now, before I go too far, I do have scripts for all of this for you, and they're in our free 446-page hypnosis manual right in the link below this video. So you can download it right after the video. It'll give you all the information you need. So for the analytical people, I still use the five-step hypnosis process, but it's done a little differently than the one I showed you for the non-analytical people in the previous video. Okay. Here's what's done. You do the induction, which is where you relax them. You do the depth test, where you find out how relaxed they are. But the difference is, when you do the depth test, if they pass it really well, you continue with the non-analytical session. However, if they don't react well to the depth test, that shows you that they are analytical. So in that case, Instead of going to a deepener and relaxing them more, what you do is you give them an analytical vehicle. An analytical vehicle is something that you recite to them that keeps their mind busy. It gives them a job to do. And while they're doing that job, you deliver the suggestions, which is step number four, and then you do the awakening and take them out of hypnosis. So it's a little bit of information about the vehicle. What is that? Well, let's say I told you right now, okay, close your eyes, and I want you to draw a circle about, oh, 15 inches diameter. And in that circle, I want you to draw the letter A. Now I want you to erase the letter A. Let's say you're using uh, whiteboard markers. So now draw the letter B inside the circle. And now erase the letter B. And now draw the letter C and erase it. And when I tell you to continue, I want you to continue doing that all the way to the letter Z. And while you're doing that, don't pay attention to what I'm saying, because I'll be speaking directly to your subconscious mind, which always hears and always pays attention. Just continue with your job. You might hear me, you might not, but do your job. And when you're done, then you can listen. So go ahead and continue doing that job right now. You are a non-smoker. You'll never smoke again. And I start doing the suggestions. See how easy that is? It's giving you a job and it's keeping your mind busy. Now, I kind of went through those quickly, but the hypnosis manual, when you download that, breaks it down in detail. And if you want to learn how to do it even better, because there's a lot of ins and outs having to do with it. What if this happens? What if that happens? That's what we have, our hypnosis certification 
home study course for. And the link for that is right below this video. You're going to learn how to do the traditional hypnosis, the analytical hypnosis, self-hypnosis. There's so many different methods and everything behind the scenes that you should know to be able to help someone with in case there's a problem. Like I said, no two people are exactly the same, so everyone might react differently, and you want to know how to take care of that. So now that you know how to do the analytical method, who do you know that might be analytical, and what are you going to help them with? Thank you so much for hanging out with me today. If you had fun and enjoyed this video, do us a favor and like, comment, subscribe, share, you know, all those buttons that really help us out. Also, visit our online store for our hypnosis certification home study course if you'd like to learn hypnosis or become a hypnotist. And we also have 50 specialty courses there like forensic hypnosis, memory retention hypnosis, covert hypnosis, past life regression, and many more. We also have the largest selection of hypnosis script manuals you'll find anywhere. And finally, if you'd like to just learn hypnosis for free, go ahead and download our 446-page hypnosis training manual right now in the description below this video. Again, I'd like to thank you for joining us today. I wish you the very best of success, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye now.